this is your time, this is your season, and this is your moment. I hope you're having a wonderful day. I want to let you know that anything is possible. I want you to know, go after your dreams. Don't give up. Don't throw in the towel. I'm here to tell you that anything is possible. And today's motivational video, it is going to change your life. And I want to thank you. I'm getting messages from people all over the world that are telling me that my motivational videos are changing your lives. I want you to know that anything is possible. And, and today's motivation video, it is going to change your life. And what we're going to be talking about today, we're going to be talking about go there in your mind. That's what I want you to do. I want you to do an exercise. While you're listening to this video, I want you to close your eyes just for a second. And while your eyes are shut, and while you're listening to my voice, whatever you want to do, Whatever you want to be, whatever you want to become, I want you to get it in your mind right now. And now that it's in your mind, I want you to start imagining yourself accomplishing whatever you want to do, whatever you want to be, whatever you want to become in your mind. And the title of the message today is, Go There In Your Mind. Yes, that's it's just plain and simple. I want you to go there in your mind. Whatever you want to do. Whatever you want to be, whatever you want to become, I want you to go there in your mind. My question to you is, what are your dreams? What do you want to accomplish? I want you to dream big. Let me tell you my dream. I, I've, I've already spoken in London in my mind. I've spoken in Australia in my mind. I've spoken in Canada in my mind. I've spoken in the NBA in my mind. I've spoken in the NFL in my mind. I've spoken in corporate in my mind. I've been to London, Canada, Australia, NBA, NFL, corporate, and other places in my mind. I've already been there in my mind. This is what you have to do. You have to dream it. And once you dream it, number two, you got to go to work. You got to work on your dream. And then number three, you will reap. Those are the three things you have to do. You got to dream it. And then that, that come, there comes a point in time in your life. Let me say this. Dreaming is very important. But dreaming alone will not help you accomplish your dreams. Why? Because faith without works is dead. You can believe that you want to be whatever you want to be all, all day. But if you don't put in the work, if you don't put in the action, then you will never do, you will never be or become what you want to be. Well done is better than well said. I want you to go there in your mind. I want you to imagine yourself. See yourself accomplishing your dreams in your mind. Go there in your mind. You can do it. You can achieve it. You can accomplish it. Anything is possible. Anything is possible. And today, this motivational video is going to change your life. I'm not here to just speak to you. I'm here to motivate you, to encourage you. But most of all, I am here to empower you. That's what I want to do. Because I know once I empower you, you will go to the next level. Once I empower you, you will accomplish your dreams. I can. I will. I must. You got to be hungry. And such as Dr. Aaron Thomas says, when you want to succeed as bad as you want to breathe, then you will become successful. And we know how important it is to breathe. Breathing, you cannot survive. You cannot live without breathing. When you want to succeed as bad as you want to breathe, then you will be successful. You got to see yourself starting that business. You got to see yourself going to the Super Bowl. I'm here for professional athletes. Maybe you want to be a professional athlete. Maybe you want to be a college athlete. Maybe you want to get that academic scholarship. Maybe you want to get that sports scholarship. Maybe you want to uh, pass the bar exam, uh, become a doctor or a lawyer. Maybe you want to, whatever you want to be, whatever you want to become, I want you to go there in your mind. Everything starts in the mind. Greatness, success, purpose. It all starts in the mind. So that's why 
You have to change your way of thinking. You have to stop being negative and you have to become positive. Because I'm telling you, you can accomplish anything. I went from flunking the first grade to having a reading and comprehension problem, having a learning disability. I was bullied in school. I was picked on in school. I was told I would never amount to anything. But look at me now. When I got in high school, my high school teacher, she said, Tommy, you're not smart enough to go to college. She said, Tommy, you will not graduate high school. So what she tried to do, she tried to put limitations on me. And that's what people will try to do. People will doubt you. People will not believe in you. People will try to put limitations on you. But this is what I want to tell you. Don't allow people to put limitations on you. I'm here to tell you, you can do anything. You can accomplish anything. You may be going through a divorce. You may be depressed. You may have a bad past. You may have had a bad childhood. You may be sick. You may be, you may be dealing with an addiction. You may be you may have made a lot of mistakes. You may have failed. But I want you to go there in your mind. You deserve to be successful. You deserve to go to the next level. Maybe you want to be, you can be a billionaire. You can be a multi-billion, multi-millionaire. You can come up with that billion dollar idea. You can come up with that multi-million dollar idea. You can come up with anything. Anything that's possible. I want you to go there in your mind. I want you to see yourself accomplishing your dreams. And then I want you to put in the work. I want you to go after your dreams. Blood, sweat, tears, beast mode, lion mode. 120% chasing the gazelle, being that lion, because lions are wired differently. You want to have a lion mentality. You want to have a Kobe Bryant, Michael Jordan, LeBron James, Stephen Curry, Kevin Durant like mentality. You want to have a Jeff Bezos, a Mark Zuckerberg, Warren Buffett, Bill Gates like mentality. You can take that business to the next level. You can become the CEO of that company. You can accomplish your dreams. But I want you to go there in your mind. And then, I barely graduated high school. And then, in 2009, I became homeless. I was living on the streets, begging for food, could not shower, could not brush my teeth. And then after that, I was shot multiple times. And when I got to the hospital, I was pronounced dead. It seemed like it was over. And then I finally did get into college. I got into college, but I got sick and I flunked out of college. And, they, and I got back in college on academic probation. And then I got my bachelor's in six years. Got my master's in five years. Got my doctoral degree in like in a year and a half. And now I am Dr. Tommy Campbell Jr. I did not quit. I did not give up. But let me tell you something. There are going to be times in your life that you will want to quit. There are going to be times in your life where you will want to give up. Because let me tell you something about me. There were times I was so close to quitting. I was so close to throwing in the towel. I was so close to giving up. But there was something in me that would not let me quit. There was something in me that would not let me give up. I had an authentic why. I had a reason. I had a purpose. I would not quit. No matter what I went through, I would not quit. No matter me flunking the first grade, I would not quit. Barely graduating high school, I would not quit. Becoming homeless, I would not quit. Being shot multiple times and pronounced dead, I would not quit. Fucking out of college, I would not quit. No matter what I went through, I would not quit. And I saw myself being who I am today. And now I'm a motivational speaker changing people's lives. And now this is my new book. My new book just got published. Go to Amazon. It's on Amazon. Go to Amazon and type in, you are a winner. And type in Dr. Tommy Campbell Jr. This is my new book. This is my third book, y'all. This is my third book. I, I'm a published author of three books. Here's my other two books. Go to Amazon and type in anything that's possible. And type in Dr. Tommy Campbell Jr. And type in Dream Big. And type in Dr. Tommy Campbell Jr. And this is my new book. I can't believe it. I'm excited, y'all. I am a published author of three books. Why don't you write a book? Maybe you've been wanting to write a book. 
Stop procrastinating. I'm pumped up, y'all. Let me calm down. I want you to go after your dreams. Let me tell you, anything is possible. I went from flunking the first grade, barely graduating high school, being homeless, shot multiple times, flunking out of college, to, to writing three books, and now I am Dr. Tommy Campbell Jr. Because I went there in my mind. And then, let me tell you this. If you're going to be great, if you're going to become successful, you must go there in your mind. In order to achieve it, see it, and receive it, you must see it in your mind first. I'm going to say that again. In order to achieve it, see it, and receive it, you must see it in your mind first. Without the rain, nothing can grow. I'm going to say that again. Without the rain, nothing can grow. In order for a farmer to be the best farmer he can be, the farmer needs the rain so harvest can come. So without the rain, nothing can grow. What do you mean by that? There has to be pain. There has to be rain. There has to be storms. Because when there's rain, when there's pain, when there's storms, you grow. You grow through pain. You grow through rain. You grow through storms. So many of you right now, it may be raining in your life. It may be a bad storm in your life. You may be depressed. You may be going through a bad marriage. You may have a rough childhood. You may be sick. You may be dealing with issues. You may be going through. You may have a lot of problems. You may be at rock bottom. But without the rain, Nothing can grow. You may not have the money. You may not have the resources. You may not have the connections. But just start. Don't make the excuse saying, well, I don't have the connection. I don't have the resources. I don't have the money. No, that's not an excuse. I started from rock bottom. I just picked up the camera. I knew I was gifted as a speaker. Because I've been speaking for years. I knew I was a gifted motivational speaker. So I picked up the camera. And I started doing these video, motivational videos. And now my show is, this is your time. This is your season. And this is your moment. And that's what I want to tell you. You got to prepare for the opportunities. Because you don't want the opportunity to come and you not be prepared. So I want you to prepare yourself right now for the opportunities. Because the opportunities are getting ready to come. Are you ready for the opportunity? Are you ready for the moment? See, I'm ready for the moment. I'm ready for London. I'm ready for Canada. I'm ready for Australia. I'm ready for the NBA. I'm ready for the NFL. I'm ready for the corporate. I'm ready for the moment. There has to be storms in your life because that's how you grow. Once you imagine it in your mind, then anything is possible. When you train your mind, when you train your mind to think positive and to think greatness, you can do anything. As I close, I'm closing. You should choose to be alone than to have fake friends. Whoo, that's good right there. It's better for you to be alone than to have fake friends. Last statement. It's not over until it's over. Keep grinding and don't quit. I'm going to say it again. It's not over until it's over. Keep grinding and don't quit. No matter what you are going through. No matter what you are facing. Don't quit. Don't give up. Don't throw in the towel. Go there in your mind. Please subscribe to my YouTube channel. And please spread the word all over social media about me as a motivational speaker. Please support me. I want to tell the whole world that I love you. I believe in you. Thank you. That is my time.